This is Papa Frank and welcome to another enlisted guide video. Today we are going to discuss academy train orders. Now on my last stream people asked me this and I figured I might just make a quick video on it. Let's get to it. Now to explain what train orders are I'm going to start out with a quick run through the academy. The academy is used to train your soldiers. Basically what you do is you trade in lower level soldiers that got to their max level and then you get one of them back at a higher level with their perks and stats reset. So what people usually don't know is that you can turn in soldiers of different classes to get to a higher level. So I can take two troopers and one tanker guy and there's a 1 in 3 chance, a 33% chance to get the tanker back at a higher level. Now, to avoid this, to avoid this, I can start the training and now I can choose the soldier. And what train orders do is that you can lock in a soldier and get that soldier back guaranteed at the higher rank. Why is this? Why is this good? Well, it is good because you won't always have higher level, higher level soldiers to, to, ju to just spend them on the academy. So what you can do is take troopers, as in filler soldiers, and, hel and help you guide you through, through the grind for other types, other more important types of classes, such as tankers, attacker pilots, so on and so forth. Now, <clears throat> When do I want to do this? Well, I think these cards should be used, I guess, when you're towards the end of your leveling, somewhere at rank 3 to 4. It is easier to get level 2 and 3 soldiers, but level 4s and 5s are a bit are a bit of a grind. Which, by the way, if you want to watch my take on the Academy, Logistics and Orders, you'll be able to check it out here when, when it releases tomorrow. There I'm going to explain how you can guide your grind through infantry leveling and get to the max level as in I think it's level 5. So what you want to do is use train orders to level up using fillers. You want to get you want to get a rank 4 rank 5 attacker pilot because those are the guys that usually spend spend uh, their time alone <laughs> in a fighter in a fighter plane right so you won't you won't have like free rank 5 free rank 5 attacker pilots right and it is going to be harder for you to level each and every one of them up so that you can get the next rank the next rank so what you will do is get is put in a uh, rank free rank free attacker pilot but you're going to use rank free troopers to get to the next level and the best thing to do is do this at around rank 4 or 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 at most rank 3 going downwards right so <clears throat> you don't have to level up three different attacker pilots just to get to the next rank now, how do you get more train orders? Well, this is a tricky question because right now I think you get it as a random drop from the battle pass. So far, I went through nine random orders and I think I got five train orders out of them. And I'm not 100% sure because I wasn't paying attention to it but I didn't really see any other way so far. So for me, nine random drops got me five cards. For you, it might be otherwise. I'll pay more attention and let you guys know. If I if I find it out, I'll pin a comment uh, when I find it out. Even better, if you know, if you already know, leave a comment and tell us too. And I think that's kind of it. So maybe in the future, there will be other ways of uh, of getting train orders. I know that they, they are already uh, working on they are already working on uh, reset orders or something like that, um, in which you can uh, reset squad upgrades or personnel upgrades or workshop upgrades. But anyway, 
told you I keep this short. So if you have any questions or you want to check out the more in-depth guide, you're free to do so. You know the drill, boys. Sub, like, comment, maybe share. Commander Papa needs all the help he can get. And guys, see you next time.